when we started out we were a very very young team we didn't have that much experience and then over the years we've just kind of inched our way up gotten a bit more experience and just learned how to play together as a team and the longer we've been playing together as a team the more it's it's clicked but there's nothing between any of the teams the four teams was there Karen Khan and Morn Abbey do you know probably but could have won in All Ireland as well. So I think it's it's obviously brilliant that we played such a tough game, but it was the same the other side for, for Fox Rock against Carnacon. So do you know it is good preparation. I think it would mean everything. It's almost surreal. Like we've been at this now since we started in 2004, 2005, about 10 years ago. Uh, that's always been the aim and it's been very, very gradual. But now we're finally here, it's it would just it would mean everything. I think uh, Fox Rock, we played them last year in the semi-final and they're, they're probably quite like Dunhamine, they're an all-round strong team, Do you know, they have some very strong forwards and um, Sinead Goldrick of course is, you know, top class player, Do you know, which, which will take a lot of watching, but um, do you know, I think the two teams are very alike and I think it's going to be nip and tuck, I think it's going to be a very tight game and, do you know, maybe a little bit of luck on the day too will help one of the teams. Looking at Shane O'Neill's, they they've reached the All Ireland final, so um, it's going to be a tough a tough game. Um, no matter what two teams are there, I mean they've reached the, the the last two teams in Ireland, so it's going to be a tough physical encounter. We won a junior um, Ulster in 2013, so a lot of the girls have been still playing uh, from that from that point. So um, yeah, there's a lot of long girls, but having such a uh, experience um, now in the All Ireland semi has, will really stand by them winning or just having the experience of your a local team into a county, a county final, Connacht final or Ireland final, it lifts people's spirits a bit, the flags are out, the bunting is out and it's a great occasion and we're just hoping everyone gets behind us and travels to Parnell Park on the 4th of December as well to, to, to shout for us and hopefully give us that bit of an edge as well. It would absolutely be amazing, for especially for such a small club and for Armagh it would be um, amazing because I think um, it's the first it was the first Ulster um, intermediate title brought back to Armagh, so we've made history in that sense, so hopefully it stand by us on the 4th of December. This year the real difference for our team has been our confidence level. We came back and we were determined no matter what, we were going to put the wrongs right from last year. It's just amazing to see our efforts kind of complemented by everyone supporting us and just um, recognising how well we're doing and just it's a huge boost to the ladies section in the club it's a huge boost to like the ladies youth will definitely have like strength coming through now in the next couple of years again based off this as well so it's just massive ever since we made our county final the the, the sport has been unbelievable there's bunting up in the town uh, there is a competition to dress uh, shop windows for us uh, with blue and white and um, there's posters all over the place and even last week in Ballina there was I'd say 50 or 60 people made the journey upwards from Kinsale and was huge support and very vocal support so we're expecting huge numbers at the All-Ireland Final on the 3rd of December. To get to an All-Ireland Final in St. Moore's Jersey would be just huge like just all the years we've been playing together as a team to win with the people we've grown up with. My, my, my sister plays on a team, my cousins, my best friends, everyone else has best friends on a team and sisters so it'd be just massive to play in a St. Moore's Jersey in an All-Ireland Final with those girls.